Hi, this is Marquis e. Crew, and I'd like to make a post here where I steal an idea from my friend James Dunkerley. On Twitter, he posted this, that he's answering questions on the Altrix community, and he's learning. Uh, today's new discovery that you can sum strings in a summarize tool, just change the XML and it works perfectly. So what he's got in this picture is it looks like he's transposed some data and now he wants to take this value which appears as a string and he wants to sum the results. Well that sounds kind of crazy but let's go and see what that looks like. Maybe it's not so crazy when you take a look at it. So he's got data here and you see that there's not applicable or it could be spaces maybe and what he wants to be able to do is transpose that data. And then he wants to get a sum of the value, maybe the sum of the value by customer. So I set up a summarize tool and I've got the customer here and the customer, um, I'm sorry, uh, we're going to take the name of the field. Sorry about that. Where we're going to get totals by month. And um, so we've got the name here and we've got a group by and now we come to the value and we want to do a sum. Well, you can't do a sum. It's grayed out. So what he's suggesting is that you can come in here and do, say, a max. Now, max isn't what you want, but in your options under user settings, um, edit user settings, you have the ability in your user settings to come into the advanced tab and display XML and property windows. And when you do that, you're going to get this XML view available to you. If you click on the XML view, you can see what's happening behind the scenes. And you can see that I've got value the action max and the rename is max value. Well, I can hit edit on that. And I'll just widen my screen here so you can see the whole thing. And I can change max to sum. And I could rename it to say total and hit OK. Now, if I come back to the wrench, I can see that value is sum and there's a total. And if I hit play on this, I am getting warning messages, these conversion errors, that NA is not a number. But when I take a look at the output, I'm actually getting totals. Thank you, James, for the idea. We appreciate it.